Can fasting help in cancer? Can a diet that mimics fasting can actually be the way to live longer and helps in the cancer battle? Let's find out. Hi, I'm Dr. Corassa. I'm a raw food nutritionist that have been living off raw foods for 16 years. I reversed my diabetes and a lot of health issues and I'm glad to be able to share with the world the scientific knowledge that could help all of us to eradicate diseases from the planet and to be the, our best versions. My greatest passion is to share with you the scientific literature, so let's find out about the fasting mimicking diet. I live, practice and preach a natural hygiene lifestyle that is like a model of medicine created in America for 200 years ago and we were the greatest proponent of fasting, of therapeutic fasting for like the last couple of centuries. And now the science is only proving what we have been saying for 200 years. Now even Walter Longo, one of the most famous biologists, researcher on fasting, the greatest and most powerful medicine is the medicine that comes from within, suggesting that fasting, that our bodies are able to heal us when we allow our bodies to do it. So before talking about FMD, we have to talk about Walter Longo. He was actually a student of Hoy Walford, the, the guy that created the biosphere and was one of the first in the 1980s to test the hypothesis of caloric restriction diet. That means eating 30% less than you should eat per day throughout months, years, or even your entire life could stand our lifespan and health span. So Long was quite famous for his research on fasting and cancer. And afterwards, starting, he started testing his thesis, not just in cancer, but in a lot of other diseases, like autoimmune diseases, neurological diseases. And he has showed promising effects in all of them. So let's find out. With a lot of papers published in Cell, Nature, and in a lot of other top journals, he has showed the world that fasting is actually the medical doctor that comes from within. The turns on the repairing system, the repairing mechanism, the regeneration of our own organisms. The less we eat, the more we regenerate and rejuvenate as Hygienists have been saying this for 200 years and have been conducting fasting under medical supervision. Now, Longo has been showing the lab in, in animals and in humans as well. So what is the fasting mimicking diet? He actually created a diet to help out people to not have to fast, but it still gain the benefits of fasting. I'm pretty sure that we will find out like in the near future that nothing works as good to regenerate and repair the system as a hygienic fasting. If you haven't seen my documentary, I put on the cards and in the link below in the description, but I have a documentary on fasting. I have three documentaries on fasting, a book on fasting, a scientific book on fasting, and I have been doing water fast for 16 years and intermittent fasting also. So I only eat in a six hour window for the last 16 years. And I already have done several long water fasts. The longest was 39 days. So I know what fasting can do. I have seen it, I have felt it, and I see the results. It's unbelievable, but what Longo did, it was just trying to make it easier to apply fasting in hospitals, in the daily life, so people didn't have to go through the hardship of doing a water fast, but still gain a lot of the benefits of a semi-fast, right? What he actually suggests is actually a severe caloric restriction using only plant-based foods only vegan foods, but the, his maintenance diet, his longevity diet includes fish. 
how he conducts the fasting mimicking diet in the patients. Longo has shown in labs, as others have shown, that the longevity is regulated by similar genes and mechanisms across all animal, plants, and fungi. The FMD is a five-day dietary protocol consuming only around 34 to 54 of your normal caloric intake so the body enters somewhat a fasted state, like a higher ketone level in, in the blood. So the first day is just 1,090 calories and this macronutrient ratio proportion, low protein, high fat, low carbs. So in the second to five, fifth day, it's just 725 calories, but it's almost the same macronutrients. But it's important to know that FMD is not a long-term diet. It's just a short-term fast. Once a month for obese patients looking to lose weight, or maybe two, three times a year for a healthy individual. He actually sells through a company that he created called Prolon, the FMD protocol. So you buy like a kit of dehydrated mushroom soup and a lot of other plant-based foods to eat it. But I really admire Dr. Longo for all the research and for the effort to create a, like a company for that, for helping people. But it wouldn't be actually better to just eat whole food in lesser quantities, maybe a vegetable juice fast would be way more healthier with a lot more nutrients, water, and not like, you know, dehydrated, pre-packaged with petrochemicals, you know. I don't agree with too much with like the FMD protocol, but it's a big step in the right direction. If you are not doing the FMD protocol, how should you go with diet? So while you're not on FMD, Walter Longo suggests the longevity diet. What would be the longevity diet? Eat mostly vegan plus a little fish, limiting meals with fish to a maximum of two or three per week. He suggests that to eat fish with low mer mercury. He suggests also a lot of legumes like beans, chickpeas, green peas. He suggests minimize saturated fats, sugars, and maximize good fats and complex carbs. He's suggesting a whole food plant-based diet with a little bit of fish. That's what he's suggesting. With a lot of vegetables and nuts and seeds. And he also suggests that to eat within a 12 hour period. That means time restricted feeding as we call nowadays. So my feeding window is just six hours per day. He's suggesting a feeding window of 12 hours and 12 hours fasting per day. And if you are overweight, confine yourself to two meals per day instead of three. Comment below, do you know what natural hygiene is? Have you ever tried water fasting or juice fasting or even caloric restriction or even FMD? Do you agree with all this? Please comment below. As long as shown in this research published in Nature, Fasting mimicking diet helps chemotherapy for breast cancer. So short-term fasting protector tumor bearing mice against the toxic effects of chemotherapy while enhancing therapeutic efficacy. So he already proved that in mice, but he's now proving in human beings that fasting with chemotherapy actually helps to kill the cancer cells while protecting the normal cells that he calls actually differential stress resistance. And we are going to talk about it in the next video about fasting and cancer. But in this research, he randomized 131 patients to receive a fasting mimicking diet or their regular diet for three days prior to and during the chemotherapy. And there was more clearance of tumor cells in the group that did the FMD and also reduces the DNA damage in lymphocytes. That means that FMD actually protects the patient from the chemotherapy side effects while helping to kill the cancer cells. For last but not least, Walter Longo also suggested people that do the fasting mimicking diet three times per year has a biological age 16 years younger. I went to university for a degree in nutrition, so I attend patients online and in person. 
I have almost 10 books published. They are in Portuguese and one of them, The Hygienic Fasting, is translated to English and it's available on Amazon. Nine books published, six online courses, but all in Portuguese. But we have a retreat for seven days here in Brazil, a frugivore retreat. Only raw foods, primarily fruits and vegetables for seven days, having culinary classes, lectures, a lot of things here with me. So if you want my help, I can help you out. And soon all the content will also be available in English. So don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell button and share with everybody that needs to know this information. And don't forget, click these videos here to know more.